rise and shine. <laughs> Look at that. They're like, no thank you. Somebody slept through the whole night. That's what does it. It's these, these seas. That's what gets us a good night's sleep. Right there, do you see that? A little rough out there, isn't it? But it's helping us. Right, buddy? You slept good too, right? He always does. Yeah, there's nothing stopping him from sleeping. So good morning from day three. So today's another at sea day. Tomorrow we'll be in Tortola, but today we're at sea. We've got a lot of fun things planned. We have nothing planned. No, uh, no, we're gonna go get no, breakfast first. What, what, what do we have planned? We're gonna go to the kids club. We're gonna go to the kids club. We're gonna go down the slide. We're going to eat some food. That's the first thing on the list, is we're going down to the Royal Court. No, we're doing open house. We're going in with you, buddy. So, uh, we're going down to Royal Court for breakfast right now, which is the sit-down restaurant. We tried to go in there yesterday. Uh, the line was too long. We ended up at Cabana's. So now, we're going to try it again. We're going to see if we can make it in there for breakfast. Let's go. It is earlier, so it's only like 8.45 right now. All right, here we are at Royal Court. And we're going in. All right, so the first thing they brought us out was some pastries. I got a chocolate chip muffin and a croissant. Jen got a I got lemon, a lemon and a croissant. Oh, a croissant. They brought us out some toast with some jam and some butter. We also got juices. Jackson's eating some form of a muffin over there. He got chocolate chip. Oh, oh me yeah. too. <laughs> Ooh, and I also got some fruit. Sorry for the like the rolling shutter there. That's just the lights. Because the lights are on a different phase here on the ship. So normally this would be fine. But because it's a European, it's like made in Europe, I would have to switch over to, I don't know, whatever the European standard is. Also, I just noticed that my muffin has a hidden Mickey. Look at that. Theming. I got the Eggs Benedict. I also got a, a side of waffles and some bacon. This is traditional Eggs Benedict, poached eggs, ham, and hollandaise. And then Jen got... Oh yeah, I did the, just the regular DCL breakfast. The regular DCL breakfast. So now that we're done with the breakfast, we're gonna go up to the kids club for open house. That's not the deck we wanted. We came into the Oceaneers club for open house and look what's playing on the TV. Look at that. A goofy movie. Also, Jackson's in here, turning knobs, flipping switches, defending the galaxy against Darth Vader, right? Oh, I always love seeing these things from the Star Wars universe because they always use the most random things. Like, this is a backwards speaker. This is a timer motor right here. This is a thermostat down there. One, two, three! Jackson's drawing something. Oh. Oliver's like, who's this lady? Jackson drew his baby brother right there. It's like uncanny, right? Oh, do you hear this song, Jackson? Ta-da! Whoa! That's nice, big buddy. Clapping along though. Oh, he's got it now. The youth open house is fun and like the youth activities, all the ocean air club and stuff is great, but just be careful. It is like a low ceiling in here. Oliver's out here driving RC. Something's going on. Somebody pushed the button too many times and now it's just honking. Oh, so <laughs> There's Cinderella just walking down the hallway over here. There she is. <laughs> What'd you think, bud? He's like, what just happened? <laughs> so after the kids club, we came down to level four to go to the coffee bar. It's also a full bar, the Vista Cafe. And I thought it was interesting, some of the stuff that you can get. You can get like a protein shake. You can get all kinds of different pomegranate green tea and kombucha and some core power Fairlife milk, like high protein milk. Oh, there's mine. They make me laughing. Ooh, look at that. Mickey Mouse. I also wanted to get some bottles of water, so I got these, this cooler. It's like 41 bucks for six bottles full of ice in the cooler. I know that that's expensive for six bottles of water, but it's about what you pay for bottles of water here on the cruise ship. Also up here on deck four, there is a port shopping desk, and there's some informational things here. It's kind of fun. So this is uh, port shopping on Tortola. 
Does it tell you about all different things? Oh, it, this is neat. Gives you like a map of stuff. Let's you get acquainted with what's going on at the port. Came out on the sun deck out here. Windy, it's choppy, it's deep. Look how blue it is. All right, so now we're headed back towards the aft of the ship to head for the tube. So we're gonna do a family drawing class. All right, so we're back in the tube right, and we are. Right here. He already started his drawing class. Let's see. Oh, he drew the Mickey. Look at that. Good job. Wow. But also, we don't know who we're gonna be drawing just yet. Maybe Pinocchio. Maybe not. So when we did our first cruise with Disney back, at like I think it was in like 2018, but we did a drawing class, and I still have our drawings that we did. Hey, who did we do? We did Goofy. Goofy. Yeah. That's the spoiler. Whoa. Buddy, that looks amazing. This is art. So this is Baby Brother. This is a monster, a monster truck? truck going up a hill, but he lost his wheel. Mm -hmm. And then this is another one with a big spoiler. And this What's one is a cherry. What is this? No, that's not cherry, that's a, a germ. A germ? A germ. <laughs> that makes sense. Some like, what is that, like staphylococcus or something like that? You know. As that you... was one of my favorite things that we did though on that that's first cruise Mickey was the, the, that is the Mickey Mouse that you drew. You did really good Mickey Mouse. Oh man, buddy, that they're was... doing a scavenger hunt in the kids club right now. Ooh. So we did try to go to the kids club and we decided maybe we're not ready for it yet, but we're gonna try it again, right? I think that's me. Yeah. I will. I will I'm give you. Going to try to get it. <laughs> I will give you this piece of advice. On the wish, he could use the slide to go down to the kids club, and that was the turning point. That's the only time, that time that he ever spent time in the kids club, yeah. was because he could go down the slide to get into it. We're gonna draw Dumbo. Draw Dumbo, who's obviously on the back of this ship. Have we all seen the Dumbo? Not the whole thing, so just the top. Have your it's okay. Circle, you can do the whole thing. Your it's your Dumbo. Half a flatter circle. Oh, amazing. Above it. Perfect. Oh, by the way, my name is King Candy. Three <laughs> 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 years in. Not yet. Not, not yet. yet. I just did. Yeah, yeah yours looks really great, good. Buddy. Kind of looks like a Ninja like Turtle at this point. <laughs> okay. Whoa. Let's go on to There's a cloud in the sun. Amazing. In the eyebrows. In the eyebrows. It starts wider at the top and goes. I don't know what that is. More like Bing Bong. Pretty neat color thing. His little circus outfit. I will do my prize. This is amazing. I messed up a little bit. You did great. Feather, that'd be cute. You just add a feather. You can add Dumbo? whatever you want into oh. a curve. Well, you drop so you're basically doing a right middle here? curve and then you're reversing it either side. Oh, Ooh. So almost like a smile look, look on at, this side. Look at ours. <laughs> wow. Oh, yours is amazing. His antenna, has six eyes, and his little tiny smile. Look at two for the price of one today. Look at that. Are we paid for this? <laughs> and then I'm just characters. There it is. There's my green alien. Minutes. And Jackson. they're not easy. He had like time to draw like a rocket ship. <laughs> So I'm just going to go ahead and finish up all those over lines. There. If you want to shave little green alien is doing like a little cool can. dance. All right, so we came back to the room to drop off our drawings and my giant cooler full of waters. <laughs> and now we are headed back out. We're going to go to lunch right now. It's like 1.10. The gonna restaurant the... stops letting people in at 1.30. Because we're going to do the sit down we're gonna go lunch to over at uh, Royal... Royal Court. Yeah, which is where we had breakfast. Where we had breakfast and where we had dinner the other night. Like this. So, like we're in there right now. I feel like I always forget to show us walking in. This is the atrium, deck three, midship, Royal Court. This is where we've eaten the most on this cruise ship. I feel like Minnie Mouse is just kind of like wandering around the ship. She's just making sure everybody's doing okay, having a good day aboard her ship. Sorry, I had to run out to go all the way up to get some pizza for Jackson, because that's what he wants. Oh, she's checking herself out. There she is. It's a perfect likeness. <laughs> but yeah, I ordered Jackson some, some pizza from upstairs. And then Jen ordered everything else. She got, where'd you get the fish cakes? These are the Thai fish cakes and the creamy tomato soup. Yes, I okay. will. And this is the, what, the prosciutto? We also got a house salad here. These numbers look pretty good. What kind of bread was this, do you know? I'm, I'm not really sure. There, a regular... was like a, there was like a, a wheat. Yeah, yeah. Yes. What? Oh, you need to cut more? Okay, mm. there it is. There's the burger. It looks pretty good. I wonder if I can get some, some ketchup and mayonnaise or anything. Yeah, and then some french fries. Jen got the curry. It was the mild chicken curry. Mild chicken curry. With mango, rice, and um, papadam. It looks interesting. Yeah, I just wanted to try something different. So after lunch, we're headed back down to the room, get our bathing suits on. Gonna have some pool time now. 
But we're teaching Jackson an important lesson right now because he said, the room is this way. And I said, are you sure? I think it's that way. He's like, no, it's this way. And I was like, all right, let's go find out. So he's looking for our room now, right now, which is not this way, it's that way. <laughs> so we'll see what happens when we get there. What did you find out down there, buddy? Um, there's a dead end, let me show you. Is that where our room is? No. Oh. Let me show you. It's, a dead so it's end. definitely not this way. Oh, well, there's a laundry room, though. We'll need that. It's a dead end. Oh yeah, this is where the rooms end. Look at that. There's only three more rooms. We can oh, get no, to the other side. Well, no, hey, wait, wait, wait. We'll work out. The, we're not going. We're not going that way. That's that's the other side. But Jackson, oh goodness. Oh no, it was a bad idea for me to get him to do a lesson here. Down the hallway. Oh no, but this isn't the side that we're on. This is the other side of the ship. <laughs> all right, so now we're all dressed into our bathing attire, as they would say in the UK, our bathing costumes. No, they're swimming costumes. Swimming costumes. But we first we have to run down to the laundry room, pop a quick load of laundry in there, then we'll head up, go swimming, come back down, move it into the dryer, then probably go to dinner. I'm giving you guys a play-by-play -play of the day, <laughs> just letting you know what's going on. Oh, whoa! Cool. Look at that. Dragon. You guessed there was a dragon. I already made it to Mr. Ray. So he's in it. You look like you got all wet. <laughs> what happened? He's in the slush pad. Oh. He's in the slush pad, Daddy. Get it. Get it, baby boy. Get it. Whoa. 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 Are you doing it? Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah. Oh, he's learning dangerous activity from the other kids. You going back through? Think of this pool, Jackson. Good. He's like losing his mind because he can do whatever he wants to. So we are all done at the pool. Now it's dinner time. So we're headed down to Enchanted Garden. Gonna have a delicious dinner. And then the world's our palm tree, really. We gotta get the kids back in here to go to sleep. Then we might all go out to go maybe do some trivia. Definitely gonna meet some characters. We're gonna try to do some fun stuff tonight. So Let's do it. Promise I'm not gonna fall asleep early, although it is a cruise. So, you never know. Falling asleep early is what we do on cruises. He's making his way through. It's been getting pretty wild down here. This is where we're going, Jackson. No, no, this way. No, it's right there. I'm looking right at it. There it is. We're going to Enchanted Garden. Look at all this art. Deck one is like getting off the ship. So I feel like when this ship was new, it was a bigger deal, but Enchanted Garden used to change throughout the night. It would go from daytime to nighttime in the Enchanted Garden. All right, what are we getting here? Ooh, okay. What am I gonna get? Roast chicken? Or oh, maybe I want the pork. Yeah, I might get the pork. For the baby, we got this puree again. Pretty much the same thing that he got last night. Yeah, and then the salmon, but tomorrow we're gonna do the chicken for him. This is the Applewood Smoked Bacon Wild Mushroom Tart with creamy leeks. Oh no, there's leeks on this boat. Eh, that's funny, right? This is the Cucumber Garden Roll filled with julienne carrots, bell peppers, and zucchini Flavor with cilantro and dressed with white shoyu and lemon dressing. Look, the flowers open. Yeah, it's starting to change. Here's a look at the inside of that mushroom tart. Also, the lighting, like the mood is changing here. It's like nighttime. Well, you, you guys missed it. We went through sunset. It was like very orange. Oh, I showed it. And that, that changes too. Yeah, now it's like getting to be nighttime. You start to see stars, right? 
She has stars. And then what did you get then? This is the tuna and avocado tower with soy sauce and wasabi cream. Jen got the sea bass. So I have just been getting everything our server recommends. And he hasn't been wrong yet. Ooh. Yeah, this looks amazing. It's sea bass with a spring pea risotto and a shaved fennel on top with a Riesling wine sauce. Wow. Yeah. Also, Jackson got the chicken and they cut it up for him. Look at this. That's, that, like, really that's, a, that's a lima bean. Remember when we were talking about lima beans? Lima bean. You want to try one? And then I got the steak, the prime rib. It's pretty okay. Kind of gristly around some sections, but we'll see. See how it looks or see how it tastes. This is how Jackson looks too. You give him a lemon. And he's like, he's like, yeah, this is great. He's just like normal. All right. We have been told that we need to make three squares out of this. So it seems like a little bit of a challenge, so we're gonna try to figure it out. Do you think that's the right answer? That's three squares, right? We'll ask him. For dessert, all of us got the chocolate brownie sundae, peanut butter brownie bites with rich chocolate ice cream, whipped cream, and chocolate fudge sauce. Jackson wanted me to show his. He got a mango sorbet. Yum. Yummy. The world's biggest spoon. Somebody's tuckered out. So he had a big day in the splash pad meeting all of his friends. There's like a party happening in the middle of the atrium lobby. Jackson's dancing. Also, Minnie's out here meeting. Mickey's up there. Somebody playing piano. It's wild. Photos being taken everywhere. And Jackson jumping around like a wild man. Ooh, he keeps me young. What do you think our animal is, Jackson? <laughs> It takes a minute for a second because, um, I look up, look, what? dad, dad, look, and then dad says, what's well, a frog? That's a dance party. A yeah. dance party? Yeah, we went to a dance party real quick. Where? In the lobby. What? Yeah. I just got here. The elevator line was so long. Oh yeah, we just walked up the stairs. Oh yeah, I couldn't do that. And a quack, 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 quack. The dance is done, but we'll be back. After dinner, we came back, we got ready for bed. We read Barnyard Dance. Yeah. <laughs> Oliver and Jackson and Mommy are going to go get ready for bed. Yeah. And Daddy is going to go out and hit the town. Hit the road. Wait, Mom, hit the road. Oh, oh, yeah. It's not the fireworks for today. No, no there's, there's a tomorrow. tomorrow. <laughs> Don't worry. We'll stay up for the fireworks tomorrow, yeah. buddy. Yeah. You won't get to... You, Daddy won't let you skip the fireworks. Don't worry. I mean, if, you get, if you're very tired tomorrow, you can the skip the dark, fireworks. Dark room. No, in the great green room <laughs> there was a telephone and a red balloon and a hey, picture Mom, of Dad, the cow inside. jumping over the moon <laughs> and there were three the little bears balloon. sitting on chairs and one little and baby two little kittens <laughs> and a pair of mittens and a little toy house a and a young mouse a and a comb <laughs> you gotta admit being on deck six has been pretty great we haven't really taken advantage of it but Come down one level, take a quick stair trip down. Boom, atrium right there. Quick and easy. So we're gonna wait around and see if we can see any characters, see any sort of like shows or anything like that. Some music acts maybe. I came down to D Lounge because in the app it said there was family karaoke. Oh, it's this way. I was like, where is it? Oh, yeah, there they are. Whirling storm inside. It's a sing along. It is. Heaven knows it's <laughs> <laughs> Tell you what, I wasn't originally going to go into the family karaoke because it didn't seem like there was anybody in there, but that was a blast. Like, kids were up there singing, kids were taking microphones from their parents and trying to sing. It was great. It was a good time all around. Now I'm heading down to the lobby to see Cinderella, I think. She should be out in about 15 minutes. It was very hot in D-Lounge though, by the way. Sorry, we're up on level four, just off the atrium is where D-Lounge was. So there's the atrium. D-Lounge was just over here. Towards the, which way are we headed in this ship? That's the front, towards the end. Now we came out to the lobby. There's Mulan over there. And then Cinderella over here. How's it going, Cinderella? You having a good day? I'm doing okay. I wanted to ask and see how Jacques and Gus Gus were doing. Oh, they were just playing an evening game of shuffleboard with fairy gods. Oh. Have you been able to play yet? No, not yet. It's been taken up the entire time. Oh, fair enough. Well, I can't say that they're very good at it. 
Oh. We like to sit on top of the discs as we shuffle them along. <laughs> that sounds like fun, though. Yes, it does, doesn't it? Yeah, is it okay if we take some photos together? I would love to. Huh? So I have these backdrops over here, which I think are... This one's pretty fun because you could act like you're out on the front of the ship. But this one's kind of funny because it's just like the railings. How's it going? But like, you could just take that picture outside, right? You're just like pretending like you're on the outside of the ship, but you're really inside. There's also an elemental photo op back here where you could take a picture in front of the fireplace, which were Bernie and Ember's, like well, Bernie's place, and then Ember was supposed to take it over. It's a long story short. We'll just call this Barney's place. Tiana came out, and I guess there's the, something going on with the teenagers on the ship where they're trying to log as many photos with characters as possible. They said that princesses are worth more than they are than like these other characters. So um, I don't know, do you guys know anything about this? It really does make the cruise line stuff magical because Tiana's just like walking around over by the elevators. Look at that, now Snow White's just out and about talking with people around the atrium. Signing autographs. Donald's making his way out. That means that Daisy should be out soon. We're in line for Daisy right now. She's gonna be right here at the bottom of the stairs. Daisy, how's it going? You having a good night? I'm doing great, doing great. I gotta admit, your outfit, on point. It looks fantastic. Whoa, that was quite the spin. So do you have any plans on like Tortola or at St. Thomas or anything? Yeah, shopping, trying on different clothes and stuff like that. I like it, I like it. Ooh, yeah, perfect. Is it okay if we take some photos together? Excellent, thank you. So at 9.30, people start coming out of the dinner and the show is let out. And so it starts to get a little bit more popular. Like 15 minutes ago, there was nobody, there was no music. Now there's people starting to make their way around. Also on the way up to meet Donald, I stopped and took a selfie with Snow White. And there's a band playing in the middle. Oh snap, Snitch just, look at him, he's running around like crazy. I was running people over. Look out. And now Mulan's up there too. There's quite a lot of activity right about now. 9.30, that's the time to come out. Stitch tried to get everybody over there dancing and it didn't quite work out for him. Now Rapunzel has come out to join in the crowd. How's it going with my number one duck? You doing okay? Now I have an issue, right? Why are you not a captain of one of these ships? You're the only one with sailing experience, right? What is going on here? Maybe the treasure will be you? That's what we're hoping for, right? Fingers crossed. I think you deserve to be captain of all of them. You deserve an entire fleet. Yeah, let's do it. Is it okay if we take some photos together? Yeah, let's do it. All right, now we are headed down to the tube. Cause they're gonna be doing some, a couple of like game shows down there that I was interested in seeing. I haven't been to any. One's called Pop and one's called Seriously. All right, back to Europa. Somebody's playing U2 on the violin back here. Or no, this isn't U2, this is if I could rule the world. What is this, Coldplay? Now we made it into the tube. Oh, seriously. If you were to eat one food for the rest of your life, what would it be? Chicken nuggets. Yeah! For the rest of your life? Yep. Chicken nuggets doesn't even have cheese. <laughs> I'm down with anything that has cheese on it. Barbecue cheese? What is anything barbecue? All right, all right, all right. I like that. You guys are great. Like cheese. I love cheese. I forgot. Do we own them? Listen, like I said, the more that we talk about any other product, the quicker Disney buys them. Be any vegetable. Which vegetable would you choose? Oh, my first reaction was a carrot, because this is a true story. When I was a kid, I would only eat like carrot baby food, so my parents fed me so much that I actually started to turn orange. Serious? That's true. Seriously. That happens? Like a flamingo? Yeah, but orange. I was a baby. Three questions, and it's going to be fun, because at the end, you get to win big. Woo! You don't even know what you're winning, but you're winning something, because I love giving away, giving away Disney stuff. I didn't pay for it. They said give it away. I give it all away. With this game show, we would and if you think you know someone in this room really good, you don't have to be married, you can be best friends, hey bestie, you can both have something in common. Oh, we like Taylor Swift. <laughs> you both like Taylor Swift? Yes! Yes. Yeah. If you think you know that person, you want a chance to win and have some fun. Grab that person now and come on down here. Take the shoe that's in your right hand and 
and give it to the person that you came with. So you should have one of your shoes in your hand and the other person's shoes in the other hand. Then I'm going to ask you some questions. Once I ask you these questions, you raise the corresponding shoe to who you think is going to do the thing. Who has the smelliest feet? One, two, three. So I count one, two, three, and you raise the shoe. Now, if you don't know who has the smelliest feet, you can give it a check right now. Take a little woof. Who spends the most? One, two, three, raise. Who spends the most? Who is most likely to cancel plans at the last minute? One, two, three, raise. All right, all right, all right. Shoes down. I'm loving this. Who is most likely to drop everything and travel the world? One, two, three, raise. Drop everything and travel the world. Down That's a song. Couples. Every song is a song. Who is most likely to forget where they're parked? One, two, three, raise. Who is most likely to go commando? Yeah, let's walk around with no underwear. All right, shoes down. Still along those lines. Who is, you know what? Who is most likely to go streaking? That's when you run naked in the street. What, all right, shoes down. This is getting too good now. You got look like you're gonna have a winner right now. Next one. Out of the both of you, who would you say drinks the most? <laughs> that was too quick. <laughs> so this lovely board right here is going to be all of, oh wait, it's time for pop! Oh wow. <laughs> now in this board right here, it's fun. What's going to happen is, we're going to split the room down the middle. Over on this side, you're going to be one team. And over on this side, you're another team. And this game is all about pop culture. We're going to ask you, some trivia questions and oh you bless you you may have you may have a physical challenge now the physical challenge is not going to be extreme like ooh, grab a cup from the bar run all the way up to deck 11 grab a pool water and come back down and don't spill a drop you know you won't do that you can So send someone up from Team Amore and send someone from Rain or Drum, the ship is swaying. Now, come on up. It's a small world. Once you start it, you can't get out your head. Don't go there. I, will. I love that song. Who is, you think I'm playing games with you? Play it again. No, it's not a fake. <laughs> these kids these days. that one day, but good job. Which tile should we flip over first? D3, which is Golden Girls. So my question for your team, anyone can answer from your side. My question for you will be, who would have tweeted this? I didn't win. I'm pretty sure somebody tampered with my trainer at St. Olaf Butter Queen pageant. I didn't win. You guys can try that out. Nylon is correct! Now, name the duo. One was from Sicily, and the other was her pussycat. Sophia and Dorothy. Sophia and Dorothy? Yeah. Is correct! Yeah. 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 Where do you think the other Golden Girls are? You have three D seconds to D tell D your team captain. D3 is a match! These items best describe what family? Pacifier, saxophone, couch, duff bear. Sing it now, three, two, one. The Fresh Prince of Bel Air made this dance popular. Oh, Everyone now, stand up and show us the Carlton. I want you all to sing along. It's not unusual to be loved. Gotta admit, that was pretty fun. It was a good time. I think I prefer like the trivia stuff where you have like a, you know, it's just you participating against other teams rather than like the entire room being a team. But it was a good time. Like I think that's a drinking place for people to be 
having some drinks, playing these games. But it was fun. He was really funny. The yo-yo guy was really funny. But now, headed back to the room, going to sleep. It's about 11.20. Um, tomorrow, we're on Tortola, and we have an excursion plan, which is a beach break. We don't have it until like 12.45 though, so it should be a nice, easy morning. So today was a fantastic day. Got to do a lot of stuff. We went to the pool, we ate some food, we met some characters. There was some, oh, we drew. We had a drawing class. A lot of fun. We drew Dumbo and a, the, the Toy Story Alien. So all in all, it was a fantastic day. With that being said, we were off. I passed our room. <laughs> and we'll see you guys tomorrow. And now it's time to pay the price.